नमस्ते आई एम हरीश नायका असिस्टेंट ग्रैजुएट मास्टर फॉर लैंग्वेज इंग्लिश एट जीके एच पी एस अर्हतोल ऑफ भद्रावती तालूक एट शिवमोगा टूडे आई एम गोइंग टू नरेट ए स्टोरी फ्रॉम द लैंग्वेज टू ऑफ क्लास सिक्स एंड द नेम ऑफ द स्टोरी इज द स्कॉलर्स मदर टंग ओके लेट मी नरेट द स्टोरी हेलो डी एच चिल्ड्रन हव यू I hope you are doing well. Yes, I am also fine. Thank you. Dear children, do you listen stories? Do you like listening stories? Yes, this is a great joy for you. I know that. And I am also very happy to narrate a story for you. Yes, are you ready? Yes. Listen the story carefully and answer the questions wherever asked by me. Dear children do you know who is the very wisest and clever minister of the king akbar you might have heard about him yes who is that yes he is none other than birbal dear children do you know about birbal birbal is a very clever and wise adviser of the king akbar birbal has saved Akbar from many tricky situations. The one among the that tricky situations in this story. Let us listen, or let us let me narrate the story about the King Akbar and Birbal. Dear children, once visited a scholar to the court of King Akbar. Who is the scholar here? What is the meaning of the word scholar? Yes, he is nothing but pandit. A pandit knows many languages or many subjects more than anybody. Many subjects he knows in deep. So that scholar one day visited the court of King Akbar. when all the courtiers are present there along with the king so he enters the court and he speaks i have mastery over many languages i can speak many languages fluently so that and he continues and he challenges to the court is there anybody here who can find out my mother tongue yes all the courtiers accepted his challenge and they started guessing what may be his mother tongue some courtiers guessed as kannada and someone is telling marathi and someone is telling urdu gujarati malayali but the pandit refused all this replies and he made a command that yes are you ready to accept your defeat all the courtiers got shocked and they said oh no oh no this time the whole court of the king akbar has got worried this time who is going to reply now who come on tell me yes he is nothing but birbal the birbal stood up and replied to the pandit okay pandit yes i can find out your mother tongue in a day or two let me give some some time and thus this time what happens the pandit is very glad to hear the words of birbal and okay birbal you can take your own time and you can tell me within a day or two you can take your own time yes he told then that night what happens when the pandit is asleep in his bedroom the birbal slowly slowly he sneaks into the bedroom of the pandit where he was sleeping he was in asleep slowly he whispered in his ears and he took a feather and tickled his ear with a feather this time what happens the pandit got angry in his sleep and and he flew out 
he just got a fear and he started uttering the words in his mother tongue yobaradi yes this is the right time for the birbal to know what the mother tongue of the pandit is and the next day in the court everybody is gathered uh, along with the court uh, along with the courtiers and king and all and here the standing the pandit the birbal told him, told to the king akbar your majesty the mother tongue of this scholar is telugu the akbar astonished listening to the birbal hey birbal how did you find it out the birbal explained whole thing what had happened in the yesterday's night and he added his answer that your majesty in times of difficulty a person speaks is mother tongue so by listening this akbar praised the birbal way that and birbal you have proved your wit again you are wiser and you are the cleverer minister clever minister in this court then uh, all the courtiers also praised the birbal for the for his wit they have uh, they have something in their mind but they praised the birbal for this uh, uh, sense of humor and the intellectual intellectual uh, behavior of the birbal and the same thing at the same time the scholar yes dear your majesty i can uh, see uh, i just accept my defeat and birbal is cleverer than me and after telling this one that pandit went from the court with a dismay dear children do you know what is the moral of this story yes see one cannot over esteem or over estimate his knowledge we should not be pride towards our knowledge okay thank you